channel. I wanted to bring you another um, do-it-yourself Christmas gift. Um, these are going to be meant for Christmas gifts. Some of these, I mean, you could really do, especially this one here in the middle, you could really do um, that type of gift for anything, um, birthdays or Christmas or um, pretty much anything, any occasion type gift. Um, but let me show you how I assembled these and I think these are super cute. These are definitely budget friendly and um, I'm super excited, especially the makeup brush one. I thought that one turned out really cute. But let me show you how I threw all these together. So the first basket I'm going to do could be for um, any woman, a teenage girl, whoever. It really, like I would love this as a gift to be honest with you. And I'm just going to use this little bucket here that I got at the 99 cent store. Uh oh, whoopsie. And if you guys can see it has little googly eyes. I'm going to use two different kinds of brushes. So this is the first one. And then this one is the second one. I love the color on this one. And then I'm also going to use this um, paper shred as well. And that's literally all it's going to take. So um, let me show you how I'm going to put this together. So with the bucket, um, again, I got the one with the little googly eyes at the 99 cent store and inside of the bucket, this is just like crafting styrofoam that I put in there and I had to cut it up and kind of make it fit um, this bucket, but I used that. And then I'm just going to take the brushes out of the packages. So let me do that right, real quick. So that's basically gonna be the concept of it. We are just going to kind of stab the <laughs> brushes into the styrofoam and we're just going to kind of it doesn't matter how they are or how they go or whatever we're just going to kind of mix and match these little puppies here and it does not have to be perfect at all Then I'm just going to add our paper shred and I'm just going to add it all to the bottom. And as you can tell, we just kind of put them in there and um, we, there was no like particular way that you have to do it. So this is what it looks like after all the brushes are in there and then you have your paper shred in there and then you could even add makeup. Like this makeup was in a package but I just took them all out this presents actually for my daughter anyway so if this was for somebody else I wouldn't take it out of the package but it's for my daughter so you could literally just add makeup in here if you wanted to or you could leave it plain with just the brushes totally whatever you want to do um, but just to give it a little bit of extra you could add the makeup just like that and that is what that looks like super simple easy it doesn't even have to like I said you don't have to add the makeup or you can add a little bit of makeup um, but I just think this is a cute fun little gift for a woman or a teenage girl and it didn't cost a ton of money especially because I got the makeup I'm a couponer so I got the, a lot of this makeup for free or even a money maker so um, obviously if you're not a couponer or anything, then you'll have to pay a little bit for the makeup. But anywho, I think that this is an adorable gift for somebody and I really do like how this turned out. Um, I'm probably going to put a bag over this. You could put a bag over this, um, which is what I would recommend, but I hope you guys enjoy it. So this next gift is going to be for my neighbor. Um, I thought this was a cute idea to give her. It's just like a little cocoa um box gift i guess so i'm gonna use this christmas box here it says christmas wishes i thought that that was super cute and pretty everything that i have out on this table was from the 99 cent store and everything was 99 cents except for the dove chocolates that i have in this little container here those were a dollar 99 per bag which i still thought was a pretty good good deal um so yeah i got this christmas wishes box and that's a pretty large box. And then I got this little container here that says sweets for Santa. Um, and then of course the Dove chocolates that are inside of it, it's just milk chocolate. 
And then I got these two cute little Christmas mugs. One says Merry and Bright with the checks on there. So I thought that was really cute. And then I thought that was cute with the Christmas trees and stuff. Um, then I picked up this Lint candy here. Um, it is white chocolate truffles. And then I picked up this um, right here, this almond roca. So I thought that would be fun to put in there. And I thought these were adorable. This is, they're peppermint flavored sticks. They're six candy canes and they're in the shape of a spoon. And I was like, oh my lordy be. And they do have a um, young daughter. So I thought she would get a kick out of that. And I just thought that that would be the coolest thing to be able to like stir your hot cocoa with. But I don't know. I'm easily amused. So I absolutely love that. And then of course you can't have it without some hot cocoa. And then I'm gonna throw in there some cookies. And this is like a mini tin. You know how you see the bigger tins? This one's like a mini tin. And then I found this cute, cute little jar at the 99 cent store. And so I just stuffed that with some mini marshmallows. I did put the mini marshmallows in a baggie just um, cause I thought that would be a little bit cleaner even though you wash it, but still. Um, I just thought that that would be better. And um, obviously I put the back of you know, the green part of the bag in the back. So let's get started and I'll show you how I'm gonna put this together. Oh, I forgot to show this. I did get this paper shred. I'm gonna put this at the bottom of the box and I got this at the 99 cent store as well. All right, so first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to um, put the lid on the bottom of the box because when I'm all done with this, I'm not going to put the lid on it. I'm gonna obviously give it to them, but I'm not gonna put the lid on it. Um, then I'm gonna take my paper shred and I'm just gonna open this up and I'm just gonna drop all my paper shred in there. Just like that, you don't need a ton, you just need to make it look presentable at the bottom. Then I'm going to take both of my mugs and I'm just gonna place them nicely in just like that. Then I'm gonna take my marshmallows here and I'm just gonna place them right there, just like that. Then I'm gonna take the um, candy cane spoons and I'm just going to place them like that. Then I'm gonna take our cookies and I'm gonna place them right in front of our candy canes. Then I'm gonna take our other candies and place them right in front of the cookies. Then I'm gonna take our um, sweets for Santa and just place it right there. Next up is our cocoa packet and I'm just going to slide them in right here. And then just, just for an extra touch, I have these from another gift basket that my daughter made for one of her friends. And we're just gonna throw some little um, candy canes in here. Oh, that one's broken. Just like this. I'm just gonna use the rest of them. But that's literally what it's going to look like. And then you can just add a card or whatever to it. And I'm gonna give it to her just like this. And I really think that she's gonna enjoy it. And I think her family's gonna enjoy it. It's just something real quick and real simple to put together for a neighbor or a teacher or you know somebody that you, um, maybe a last minute gift, but I hope you guys enjoyed this. So real quick, I just thought I'd show you guys the gift um, box that my daughter made for her best friend. So she picked out this box. It says, Merry and Bright, Let It Snow. And I thought that was really pretty. And hers, um, she wanted hers to all lay flat so that way she could put the lid on hers. Unlike mine, my lid will not go on there, but I did put it um, on the bottom so that way she can still use that box. But um, my daughter just put in at the very bottom, I don't wanna totally um, do it, but at the very bottom she did put in that um, paper. And then she got this pretty jar. Um, and at the top it has the gingerbread man and then it has the little bow. And then in her jar she put candy canes in there. And instead of throwing the candy canes on top, she threw the chocolates in there. So I thought that was really cute. And then that's the little cup that she chose for her friend. And then she did the snowman with the marshmallows as well and the hot cocoa. And then obviously the chocolates at the bottom. But 
I think that is a great little gift idea if your um, kids have like a little friend that they want to remember at Christmas. And I think she did a great job. So I just thought I would share that with you. So I hope this gives you all some ideas, some more ideas um, of things that you can literally put together in seriously minutes. And it's an affordable gift. All right guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it gives you some more ideas, um, especially if you have maybe last minute gifts that you need to throw together quickly. These are definitely quick gifts. And keep in mind, um, I just wanted to throw it out there that the foam that I used in the bottom of that one, you could probably get foam that fit your bucket better, but that is just what I had at my house. So, um, it would probably be easier if you didn't have to cut the foam all up and make it fit the bucket. But just throwing that out there. Again, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you guys. And don't forget to go out there and make today better than yesterday. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you in my next video. Bye. Bye.